Hey, Ginormica, if you're not gonna eat your oatmeal, can I have it, huh? Bob, please, let the poor girl eat. What? If she wants it later, I can always throw it up again. What is she got to lose? That's not the point. Ginormica here is obviously still trying to adjust to her newfound monsterhood. We should be sensitive. What do you say, Doc? That we're not sensitive? Uh, wow, got a little gill in on that one. Besides, think there's anything sensitive about her? Check out those hands, are you kidding? They're like man hands, times a million. Ugh. Okay, that's it. First of all, my name is not Ginormica. It's Susan. And second of all, I do not have man hands. And third, I am not, not a monster. I'm a girl, petite and sweet. Got it? Don't look now, but Miss Petite and Sweet just put her spoon through 18 inches of super steel. Oh, look, Susan, leave the spoon. We'll just get Monga to give you another one. I don't want another spoon. I want that. Susan, dear, please be reasonable. Where would we go? Hey, how about Monster Beach? Bob, please, there's no such place. Look, I've got to do this. Otherwise, I'll just wind up staying here and settling. And for what? Wait, we'll need my latest invention. <laughs> oh, for heaven's sake, they're just homemade communicators. I happen to whip up, you know, just in case. General Monger, it's a stage four breach. What are we going to do? Hold your fudge to drop. I didn't get these birds by turning tail every time some monster showed me his ugly maw. Release the Avenger. All ground team, I want those monsters fast. What the? Oh no! What do I do? How should I know? I'm a scientist, not a roller derby enthusiast. That lot of help you are. Ginormica is entering Sector 7. Seal off all exits. Susan, the doors are closing. We have to get you out of there. No! There's the way out! Relax, Susan. You should be miles away from trouble now. Whoa! Hey! Uh-oh. Miles away, huh, Doug? Well, I could be a little off. Come on, Susan, you're both on wheels. Surely you can outskate this thing. Okay, then, let's see how you roller boogie. Sir, we have a visual on Ginormica. Understood. Stay back. This is a good test for the event. Subdue target Ginormica. I advise extreme caution. Scanning for monsters. Monster detected. Keep an eye out for monster DNA. You can use it to buy bonusy things in the DNA lab. Pick up multipliers to increase the number of monster DNA you collect. Looks like you're all clear. Target lost. Subdue. I should mention that you can jump or double jump over obstacles by using the jump button. You can duck by pressing the crouch button. The laser, Susan! Get on the middle rail, Susan! Lean your hips, Susan! Lean, lean, lean! Jump next to the walls to ride them. Go on, stick to the walls! 
Eureka! Aim on the side! Okay, even I gotta say, that's pretty good driving, girly girl. Hey, I thought Susan was skating. She is! Use the dash button to break through! I guess. Yes, yes, give us the secrets of the universe! Or some new upgrades, whichever comes first. Some pencil shavings and lead scratchings. Ha! What's the big deal? Sensible girl. Enormous, but sensible. Doesn't appear to be well defended. Press the attack button to pop. What did I tell you, my boy? Mere playthings for a monster of your stature. Press the jump button. 
When in midair, the missing link, the automatic missile turret, looks like it's routed through that control panel over there. Use a control console to get things moving. Move the target and shoot. Grabbing an enemy, move the target to lock on. You can then throw the enemy or object at will. All right, the missing link. I'm looking at the robot's schematics. It appears you'll have to deactivate several more control panels to get to the next area. The missing link. Try throwing something to get rid of those enemies buzzing around you. Ooh, that was Oh, and watch out for the mechanized troops. I thought you said this was going to be a piece of cake. Wait, a piece of cake? Really? Why do I bother? The missing link direct missiles against the car rack to use it as a bridge. has opened up another path. From here, we'll need to get you over to the other foot. That's the way inside. Hey, that wasn't bad. like a leap attack. Hold the attack button until you're ready, then release the attack. Watch out for those drones. You'll have to defeat them in order for Plan F to succeed. Plan F? What was Plan E? some fish heads. Up to 
the body of the robot. Very exciting. Hold on. Going up. Surprising even me! Great work! Yes, the DNA gathering, the upgrading, the unlocking. My plan is working perfectly. I am a great fan of science, you know. You want concepts? I have concepts. How about an electric dog polisher? Uh, okay, it needs one. All right, Bob. I've got you on my scoop. I see you. Hey! It's Insectosaurus! Yes, I see Insectosaurus. Are you kidding? How could you not? He's huge! Hypnolite is operational. Insectosaurus is fully mesmerized. What happened? It's the lights on the helicopter. They hypnotized Insectosaurus. Break the crates by pressing... by getting close to it and pressing the grab release button, then face the target and press the throw button. Crates teleport in. <laughs> I suspect that stolen alien technology. Oh, in order to deactivate the shield around the plasma ball, you'll have to first make your way to the power button upstairs. are taking him to the containment area. You're the closest one to help him, Bob. Get up to the watchtower. Bob, jump on the walls to get...
operational. Insectosaurus is fully mesmerized. Cross over grates, grab a crate before... Use the conveyor belt, but be very careful of the electrical discharges. Come out, doctor, it's all right. It won't hurt you. Not the case of Team Gap, stand by with a giant shoe. Oh. Thank <laughs> you. 
show. square on the wall. Look, a doorway. Go on, get through it. Another path. How exciting. You 
You can duck by pressing the crouch button. Oh. Ah. Susan, what happened? Susan! You can duck by pressing the crouch button. Oh. pacification weapons. You can duck by pressing the crouch button. Oh, no, Susan, here it comes. such tenacity in an automaton. Oh, to me, though. Automaton, Bob. A robot. It makes me wonder what kind of exciting cybernetic intelligence might be controlling it. In fact, it gives me goosebumps. show. 